So if you've imported anything from Datasmith through SketchUp, you may be used to seeing your UVs like this. And there's no real way of editing your UVs directly in SketchUp. So here's a really quick tip to fix this. We just come up to modeling mode up here. You come straight down to UVs over here. Come to project UVs. And bam, they're fixed. Now, once they're fixed, there's a few things that you want to be aware of. And that is the dimensions up here and the type of projection so we have currently have depth in this and let's say at the side texture will come over this side because it's better lit at the side it's quite stretched still and that's because the depth of the box projection is still quite shallow so if we come to the dimensions and we just extend it we can see that we can make it wider to about one blank wide and then if we're happy with that maybe we we'll want to move it you can use the pivot here to slide your texture around and we can just line it up with the edge and you can do the same here let's say we want wider planks we can extend it or make it smaller and this is all without changing the material and so yeah i just wanted to share that real quick because it's probably going to save you a headache and some time and if we're using something like lumen for lighting and we're not doing path tracing we'll all of our objects should be separated into individual meshes anyway for lighting calculations so it means that you can use this on most of your entire project. Anything that's rectangular or box like you can just box project and even circular objects. There is a cylindrical project or a cylinder project option as well. If you have a box and you're getting stretched UVs at the side, it's because the projection type is still set to plane, which means you're just going to get this type of stretchiness here because it's on plane. But if I go to box, let's say, you'll see it's back to normal because it's projecting around the entire box. And yeah, so I just wanted to make that video real quick and uh, go over it because no one seems to talk about it and it's really useful and highly efficient.